Hi, I'm Storm Trekker 18 meteorologist Jess Langlois. A cold start to the morning, feeling wintry, but the cold isn't the only winter weather on the way for today. So far today, we made it down to negative two in Eau Claire early this morning, negative 10 in Rice Lake. There were some areas in the teens below zero this morning. And now that's not the only issue we're looking at. While temperatures will be warming above zero today, we do have winter weather on the way as well. Now there's pink color is a winter storm warning that's contained to southern Wisconsin as well as parts of Iowa. Those are the areas that are supposed to see the worst impacts from this system that's about to impact the upper Midwest. Heaviest snow totals, worst travel conditions, but even here in the Chippewa Valley, we are under a winter weather advisory, so that means that we could still see difficult travel tonight and through Wednesday morning, starting with the evening commute today through the commute tomorrow morning, although the peak of it will be during this evening between about the evening commute and midnight. Here's when snow arrives for us. Thankfully, we will make it through most of our Tuesday dry and just with clouds in the area, but we will start seeing snow approaching as we head into this afternoon. Areas closest to the border will be seeing snow by this afternoon. The Eau Claire area late this afternoon, early this evening. We should start to see some flakes flying and should have some flakes probably by the evening commute. There could be some slippery areas during that time frame as well. But the bulk of it will be after that and then further to the east starting later on this during the first few hours of this evening. Here's how that plays out for us. We've already seen cloud cover slip in this morning after a mostly clear night that allowed us to see those cold temperatures and we're going to see those clouds throughout the rest of today. Really not expecting to see that sunshine. Snow does continue to approach as we head into this afternoon. Should be close to the border by early to mid afternoon. The worst of this system though thankfully going to pass to ourself. Still enough though that we will see snow in in our area as well. By six o'clock, most of us will be seeing at least some light snow. The southern Wisconsin will really be getting some of the heaviest snow during that time. For us, we'll see light to moderate snow throughout the duration of the event. Most of it falling between the evening commute and about midnight. Snow becomes lighter after that, but still a chance for lingering flurries into early Wednesday. And also road conditions could still be slippery through the Wednesday morning commute as well. Clouds linger into Wednesday, and then we will see a partly cloudy New Year's Eve. In terms of our snowfall totals, what we are expecting is the heaviest snow south of our area. That's going to correlate with the areas that are currently under the winter storm warning. For us in the advisory area, still looking at a couple inches of snow in most areas. The most of it will be in southern areas like Jackson County, Tremplo County, even parts of Buffalo County could be seeing some snow totals in that three to seven inch range. So there could be some isolated totals that exceed five or six inches, but most of us will see less than five inches of snow. And in the Eau Claire area, most of us a couple inches anywhere between one and four inches the most likely outcome for us here in Eau Claire. There could be some areas to the north that see a little bit more of that. Now for today we're looking at temperatures in the mid 20s. Cloudy snow develops this afternoon and evening. Snow overnight the heaviest will stay south but still light to moderate snow throughout the overnight. Snow tapers into early Wednesday and a chance for some lingering flurries. But most of the day will just be cloudy. We're partly cloudy on New Year's Eve. Temperatures in the 20s. Both Thursday and Friday morning we start in the single digits close to average for this time of year, but still chilly. Friday another system grazes Wisconsin. Thankfully we are looking at only minimal impacts here. Slight chances for snow and then dry Saturday. Just a slight chance for some flurries on Sunday. The biggest impactful weather of this week will be tonight into tomorrow morning.